Yo, what's going on, everyone? It's your boy D. Lloyd. So on Friday, Chris Mannix of Yahoo Sports, NBA Insider, there he joined Colin Cowherd on the herd on Friday, and he was speaking about Kevin Durant, and he said some things, of course, that a lot of people caught attention to. And they're now thinking about it, if it's a true possibility or not. Now, he was speaking about Kevin Durant. We all know he signed a one plus one deal, which means he could theoretically become an unrestricted free agent in the summer of 2019, which is just next season. But what he said raised some eyebrows a little bit. So Chris Mannix, he said, I don't think he finishes in Golden State. Look, after next season, he's going to have $80 million in his pocket from the last three years, probably three championships. So at 30 years old, Kevin Durant is basically going to have a blank canvas. He can do whatever he wants knowing that his legacy is secure. There will be a lot of teams trying to recruit him. I think Kevin Durant wants to hear those recruitments. I think Kevin Durant will also be open-minded next summer when it comes to where he wants to go. But I keep going back to Oklahoma City. I keep going back to the fact that everything we know about Kevin Durant, the sensitivities, how much he hates the fact that people say he jumped on Steph Curry's bandwagon, and the fact that he's been he's there's no bridges burnt with Oklahoma City. The relationship with Russell Westbrook seems to be the best it has since he has left Oklahoma City. I know that there's some financial gymnastics that have to get done before Kevin Durant can get on the roster, but I believe come at the end of the year, he's going to take a long look at Oklahoma City. End quote. So is this a true possibility? It's definitely something that, like I said, is going to raise eyebrows. Can you see, can you fathom Kevin Durant going back to OKC, the team that he left? He didn't get traded. He left. Now, we've seen a similar thing with LeBron James. He left, won a couple championships, then he went back to Cleveland. Can we see the exact same thing from Kevin Durant? You leave, win two, possibly three championships, and then go back to to OKC. Now, if he goes back to OKC, of course, they're going to have to get rid of a couple of players to be able to sign him financially, unless, of course, it's a sign and trade, which I don't see happening. So Kevin Durant possibly going back to OKC. Yes, it sounds good on paper. Will it happen? I don't believe it will happen. So I'm not down in Chris Mannix at all. But if you ask me right now, I don't see Kevin Durant going back to Oklahoma City. I do think there is a possibility, and I just made a video about this a few days ago. I do think there's a possibility that Kevin Durant will look into other teams and possibly leaving. Could that be the New York Knicks? It could. Could it be another team? It definitely could. The Lakers, of course, always in there. I don't see that one happening. But I think Kevin Durant could take a long look at another team and another situation. Because Kevin Durant right now, I think he is realizing no matter what he does, that stigma of you going to the Golden State Warriors is always going to be there. And you see that he is fed up, but he's not going to change the narrative and how the media and how the fans are going to think about it at this point in his career. Winning more championships isn't going to stop it, at least for now. Maybe down the road, long term from now, people kind of forget about it and the hatred isn't there as much as it is right now. But people are forever going to call Kevin Durant a snake for what he did by deciding to leave. Like I said in the previous video, I'm all for players going to whatever team you want, but you also got to know the image and the stigma that's going to come with deciding to leave and going to a team like Golden State, a team that won 70 plus games in a season and you went ahead and joined them. That's always going to sting when it comes to his legacy. And I think he wants to kind of change that a little bit, but the only way truly to get rid of that is to go to another team and then try to win a championship for that team. Will it be Oklahoma City? I doubt it, but it could be. I think it could be another team as well. You guys let me know. Do you guys think Kevin Durant will ever return to the Oklahoma City Thunder, or do you think he will just go to another team, or do you think he'll simply stay in Golden State for the remainder of his career? Let me know how you guys feel about that in the comment section below. It's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm going to see you next time. Peace.